next up, the penultimate event of the evening. This too is going to be a mouth-watering race as it is the final of the women's under 2200 meters. The better clack also the record hold on this one. That record not under threat as it was in the under 18 200 meters. For the uh, final of the women's under 20 200 meter, Banker Scumbi in one, Tain Lutter in two, Sydney Ostazen in three, Juanita Lefifu, watch her in four as the heavens start to open, Kelly LaRue in five, Kelly Lachancy in six, Nicole von der Vestas in seven, Rodé Nell in lane eight. Of CGA and she gets out of her blocks really, really well, chasing down her compatriot Kelly Lachancy on the outside, Lefifu going well, and it is uh, Casey, Kaylee LaRue that is coming out here into the home straight, but she's got work to do because outside of her, Kaylee LaCrancy is going well, and LaCrancy is taking this. She's pushing on. Ah, oh, who's it going to be? It's going to be CGA, that's for sure, but it is LaCrancy on the line, 24.07. Woo! Surprise package there, Kaylee LaCrancy dipping just Kaylee LaRue and Juanita Lefifi having to settle for third. Well, I tell you, Kayla Lechranzi from Randberg, she just reclaimed her crown. She's, for the past four years, she was indomitable. And this time around, she's been taking a big loosing from these girls that she was busy running with. And now today, she comes at the ASA Championship and she stuns the queens of sprinting. Lachranzi there of Central Gauteng Athletics upsetting the apple cart. Kayla Lachranzi taking gold, reclaiming her title here in the women's under 20, 200 meters. 24.04, edging out Kelly LaRue, who'd come into this race with the fastest time. Sydney Westhazen, the bronze medalist, and Rodé Nell having to settle there for fourth.